Hi, I'm Kayla, and today let's talk about the tool chest in Bluebeam Review. Welcome to Bluebeam University. The tool chest is a powerful feature in Bluebeam Review that allows you to organize and store tools in groups called tool sets. This feature gives you access to preloaded tool sets that are designed for specific workflows, such as design review and quantity takeoffs. This makes it easier to find and use the tools you need for your workflow, saving your time and increasing efficiency. You can also visit support.bluebeam.com to download more tool sets. To access the tool chest, click the tool chest panel icon. If this icon is not visible, right click the panel access bar, click show, and select tool chest. Once the tool chest panel is open, you will notice there are already tool sets available. My Tools is a permanent tool set where you can save your most used or favorite tools. Tools added to My Tools will remain even after closing review, so you can easily access them every time you use review. Recent Tool stores your most recently used tools. However, it will reset every time review is restarted. The remaining tool sets depend on the profile you are using. Let's select a profile to view. Click the review dropdown, hover profiles, and then click review. Now the tool chest contains architect, contractor, and engineer review tool sets, as well as tool sets for measurements and symbols. You can also create your own custom tool set. To do so, click the tool chest dropdown Select Manage Toolsets and click Add. Press New, type a title, click OK, and save to your computer. You'll then see the toolset listed at the bottom of the tool chest, and you can begin adding tools to the set. To permanently move a tool from one toolset to another, or to permanently store a recent tool, either click and drag the tools icon to another toolset, or right-click the markup on the drawing. Click Add to Tool Chest and select the desired tool set. To delete a tool, right-click on its icon and select Delete. Markups in the tool chest have two modes that you can work with. Properties mode and drawing mode. Properties mode creates a new markup that has the same visual characteristics of the markup you added to your tool chest, but does not retain the exact dimensions or any text from the original markup you saved. This allows the markup to be flexible and duplicates only the properties of that markup. In properties mode, the tools icon in your tool chest will show as a regular icon for the tool with a custom color. Most tools are set to property mode by default. On the other hand, Drawing mode creates an exact copy of the markup you saved, as if copying and pasting the original markup. This mode can be used for symbols and other markups that you do not intend to modify. In drawing mode, the icon in the tool chest will show an exact preview of the markup. To switch between modes, double click the tools icon in the tool chest. You can adjust how you want to view each tool set by clicking on the settings gear icon. Clicking on symbol displays the icon of each tool, and details shows the icon of the markup, subject, comment, and label in the table. In the tool chest settings, you can also set the scale of a tool, which is useful when working with documents that have multiple scales, so your markups can adjust to the drawing automatically. To set the scale, enter the known scale or use the calibrate tool to measure a known distance, such as a doorway. Once finished, click OK. You can also export tool sets to share with others, such as your team, so that everyone is using the same markups. To export a tool set, click the tool set settings icon and click export. Now select the folder where you want to store the file and click save. You can now share it with your team who can import it. To import a tool set, click the tool chest dropdown, select manage tool sets and click import. Locate the BTX file and click OK. Thanks for joining us today. To learn more, you can visit university.bluebeam.com.